gosh. What's up, casuals? Don't mind me getting cozy in my new bedroom because this is where I'll be storing all my video game collecting at. So, who knows? Maybe I'll make a series chronicling my latest impression on all things gaming. I mean, what do you think I was gonna do? Make a game dating app? You ever had that one random night where you watch Before Sunrise and thought, wow, love can be so precious. And now here's my bloody Valentine in 3D. I should get a dating app. The past two years have been rough times for the whole world, causing everyone to rely on the digital future to make connections. If you haven't noticed, I've been staying busy. There's a catch though. Dating is a skill. Clearly, I don't even have that skill because I can't find a girlfriend at a grocery store and invite them to watch, uh, I don't know. Scout Pilgrim vs. The World, that'll be a good one. Marriage Story, kind of ironic. Five dates. This is a PS4 game? Finding Love is a numbers game. Yeah, I can tell with this cover art alone. So Five Dates is a live action interactive romantic comedy where my man Vinny here uses a dating app for the first time and sees which five contestants wins the act of love in a world where physical touch is no longer an option. Looks like developers made good use of their free time for the past two years. I mean, look at me, I'm barely considering dating now. So this should be the perfect opportunity for me to use a little practice before taking the big swing in the real world. Which reminds me, I should get ready. First, a refill. It's been a long two years, so I gotta be in the right mood for this. Now, I do love my professional beard and robe, but I gotta change it up a bit. How about a fresh look to start off a new year? Alright, I'm all fresh and ready to go. Can't wait to find my true love tonight, so I'm starting up the game now. So first, we gotta set up our dating account. Cool. So I'll pick the last photo over here as it shows not only how adventurous I can be, but also the clouds representing smokes of the world that we currently live in is on fire. You know, establishing optimism I never had. Industry, creative, interest. Food, party, and tech, the circle of life. Okay, now, uh, star signs. I'm not too familiar with this. So I'll randomly pick uh, Leo, as in Leonardo DiCaprio being my all-time favorite star. And all right, we got a trophy. Feeling really good about my accomplishments already. Jesus, 40 pounds for a premium account? That's a bit steep if you ask me. So fortunately, we're gonna have to pick three of the five potentials. Okay, I have a really good feeling about Saffron. I admire someone with creative culture and spirituality. Plus, you gotta love pink linings. May is a party girl, so I gotta make room for some fun. Then uh, let's do Grace. If she likes travel and food, I'm very interested to see how much of a foodie she is. Oh shit, it looks like I've hit all three at once. Thankfully, I got my wingman over here to set me up for the proper date. Is this a good setup? I've got this right. Uh, you know what? I don't think you should have the bed in the back like that, man. It sounds like the wrong message. Okay, I'm definitely moving into the living room. Okay. Oh, trying to look like a slut. Ugh. Oh, Ugh, oh, Vinny. What's my intention? Vinny, we've spoken about this. It's, it's, it's just wrong, man. It's wrong. All right, now it's time for us to start dating. Let's do this. I was just doing yoga and I like completely zoned out. Do you mind if I just tidy this up for one time? I'll be really quick. No, please, please, go ahead. Thank you so much. I have to, to wait. Tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm no professional, so but like first dates are pretty awkward. There was some very sweaty energy in here. <laughs>
Okay. I'm with you. So throughout the game, you simply watch the dates play out while picking prompts within a limited time frame on how you want your character to approach your girlfriend. We've been taking turns to lead uh, hit sessions over video calls every day, so... Wow. Yes. You must be getting a lot stronger if you've been doing like hit every day. Ooh, well, I keep myself busy with a rank. Drop and give me 20. You, you mean what, right now? Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> okay, um... Oh, one. That was one, yeah. <laughs> so sorry for me. I did not think I'd be doing this right now, my day. Okay. Oh my gosh. I can't. Oh, wow. <laughs> Dude, you suck. I haven't asked, what is it that you do for a living you know, when you're not breaking the ice? Um, I'm a project manager for an animal welfare charity. Oh my goodness, that's really cool. I've actually been a vegan for about 10 years. Do you mind if I ask what you eat? No, no, not at all, it's... Well, I do love steak, so... Why bullshit her? Me? Oh, really? Well, it just kind of means that I can't be myself, and I don't think that that's healthy, really. Well, it's a good thing we didn't start off with a dinner date. Oh, sh this is not off to a good start. And who's, uh, who's Sally? Sally is actually an ex of mine. <laughs> I think we were dating at this point. Oh, looks like it. Oh, you, you're bi. Yeah. Is that a problem? A problem? Yeah. Is that okay with you? I'm literally all for it. <laughs> Most guys are. Although some find it threatening. Do you like horror films? Oh. Yes. I just have to give I a simple horror yes films. or no answer, yeah? Mm-hmm. Very straightforward. Oh, then this is super, super easy. Um, I, I love them. Supernatural ones, uh, psychological oh. ones, thrillers, slashes, okay. creatures. <laughs> Stop, stop, stop. I'm gonna stop you there. What? I'm so sorry. I cannot stand them. No! no! I suffer from anxiety really bad. I'm so sorry to hear that. <sighs> I mean, I can't argue with that. I used to get panic attacks really badly, so I just try to avoid like all triggers, like scary movies. <laughs> I totally understand. So, first I went pretty well. Conveniently, we can also keep track of how well a relationship goes, so it's best to stay on top of who's compatible here. Round two, I'm not gonna go B for B for every single day, so I'll just give you some of the highlights. So it looks like Maya is a language teaching assistant, but just loves the party, sounds like fun. Mm. The good thing about languages is no matter how hungover you are, you never forget them. <laughs> yeah. mm. Oh, that was fun. Boy, Maya, I finally scored some weed. Oh, really? I managed to find the only dealer working through lockdown. Come on, let's light up. Okay, I'm coming. Hope it's going well with Tom. Ooh. <laughs> uh, Tom. Tom. Okay, I didn't realize that I was uh, Tom's closing act. No. I'm sorry. That, that's a hard pass for me. Nope. Just poor Vinny. Could have got my name right. At least. Oh, how original. Anyways, let's hope the third day makes up for it. Far, it said your industry was other. I was just wondering what you do. Yeah, I'm in corporate law. Um, wow. Ooh, okay. A little bit shocked that they didn't have a litigation option. I'll, I'll send them some feedback. Sure. I'm a little bit extra like that. 
just my type. Emphasis, big foodie here and a big share of food. See, that's what I'm telling you. I'm a mind reader. I know this shit. I'm one of those people that when they go to a restaurant, I just unashamedly order everything off the menu. Starters, mains, desserts, everything. So what about your skills in the kitchen? Mm. Ah, yes. Now this is a true foodie question. Right? Mm. I obviously can cook up a storm, can you? but it's always nice when a guy knows his way around a stove. Okay. Well, I'll make a damn good mac and cheese. Let me set the scene. Okay. I've come to yours for dinner. I've got a really cute dress on. What do you cook for me? God, I would cook for you a really special plate of beans on toast. Okay, very funny. Oh God, you're not joking, are you? Dude! Man, there are times when Vinny is not as cool as he should be. Tell me the answer. What's your relationship history? I've never been in a relationship before. Um, I've never had a girlfriend. Something a lot more innocent than I thought. But either way, definitely better than the last day because odds are looking very good right now. Now we got the usual uh, debriefing if you're into this whole dating hobby. Uh, always have a friend by your side, especially when you're dating back to back. It's just a lot I keep track of. Hmm, decisions. So I have to pick two of the three of who I want to keep dating. I think Maya is an all right person, but as far as obvious choices go, Saffron and Grace it is. Second date with Saffron has us playing with tarot cards, all right? Pretty self-explanatory as we get to pick the cards we want and choose whether or not we want to talk about our past. This could go either way. And it ended with a panic attack. Saffron? <laughs> Saffron, are you okay? Oh my god, oh my god, I'm not okay, I'm not okay. I'm so... I'm so hot, I'm so hot. Uh. <laughs> uh. And now because I've cancelled I the will call. contact the Apps Incident Centre and trace her account. Okay. Her name is Saffron okay. and she's in the London area. Yeah, 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 Saffron, Saffron, that's it. Holy shit, I was not ready for any of that. Well, in the meantime... Grace wants to play Never Have I Ever. Do Luckily, I stayed there? sober throughout the whole thing. No, I haven't. Uh, yeah, sorry for being so vanilla. That's all right. I didn't say much, though, because I already finished my drink three dates ago. I have here. So what I'm the nervous. hell are these questions? Pick something nice. Are you trying to ruin our relationship? You know what? I'll keep hanging out with Saffron. Seems like an all right person, despite the panic attack. And we're gonna have a dinner date. Convenient, we get to make our own dinner. I've made my own mac and cheese already, so I'm all set. What's on the menu? So I marinated some really nice steaks. It's just been such a long time since I've had beef, yeah. Is this stuff on a vegan? Shit! Yeah, Ah, uh... oh, come on, my man. That was a rookie ass mistake right there. Do you wanna turn around and make something a little more green, bro? Okay, do you know what? I'll try and cover the salad together. Uh, so you're telling me he went from making beans on toast to making steak. Dane does that to you. Personally, addressing a panic attack is a good conversation to have in order to move forward with this relationship. We don't have to talk about it if you don't want to, okay? No, I, I think it's an important part of my life that I want you to know about. Um, I have a confession. I'm planning on going traveling for a year. I was supposed to be circumnavigating like right now and then obviously a pandemic happened, so. That's uh, that's that's cool. great. That's, yeah, um, I guess there's nothing better for the soul than traveling, so do it. Yeah, but let's say we developed further, we were in a relationship, and then I just opted and left to go traveling for a year. What, what do you think you would do? Uh, like, um... how would you react to that? I don't see why not join the fun. I think I would come with you. What about your life, your career, friends, family? I'm stable enough right now to put everything on hold if there's a person I really like and... Seriously? I am an all-in kind of guy. Okay, that is like a million brownie points. Cool. Um, sleepy incense, Bernie. 
Mm-mm. Just the lavender on my pillow for bedtime. Successful date? And that's it, I guess. Holy shit, there are over 700 scenes in this game? You know what? This game isn't nearly as bad as I thought it was going to be. I honestly expected this to be a complete disaster knowing how corny FMV games could be, except this is straight up a dating simulator. Well, obviously it's still pretty damn corny, especially when you can flip the switch and be a complete dick. Never have I ever fancied a friend's partner. I think that I'm just gonna drink this. Finny, that is not on. What? But they're your friends, they're supposed to be able to trust you. I mean, what's the harm in having a little crush? It's, it's not like I acted on it or anything. The entire playthrough can be done in roughly an hour, but it does intrigue you to go back and check out the multiple outcomes from the five dates. Speaking of which, you don't actually date all five girls in a single playthrough. Ah, it doesn't matter for me though, because I finally have my true soulmate, so I can finally watch my bloody valentine. Saffron hates horror films. <laughs>